Hi, I'm Kara from Karen Co Creative. And if you're new to me in the channel, we do both done for you and DIY websites and all manner of online business systems. Today, I have a quick Kajabi tutorial showing you how to put an image on a Kajabi pop up that you will then embed on another website, such as a WordPress or a Squarespace website. So I'll take you over my shoulder and into Kajabi. All right. So all you need to do is come to the marketing and forms section of Kajabi, and this is where you'll create your pop-up form. New form, we'll say two, save, out of the way here. So these settings doesn't really matter in terms of the style of your pop-up form. As you can see, double opt-in is recommended for sort of the spam control. Um, your form fields are here, first name and email. And this is where you would then add them to an automation if you want them to get a welcome sequence. Um, so you can you know, grant an offer or typically for a pop-up, you're gonna subscribe them to an email sequence and then select that. All right, fine. I will actually do this so that it doesn't have an error, so. So now it'll, it'll go into an automation sequence once they submit this pop-up. So embed over here is where we style the pop-up. As you can see, this is sort of the default and you can clearly see where you might change the button color and how you would change the text. But what happens if you want to add an image to this to make it look like a nice freestanding pop-up. If you're using Kajabi to create the pop-up on the website portion of it, it'll style the pop-up for you. But if you're going to embed it in another website, then this is where you want to be able to add some changes to it. So here we could keep the title, add more text. And the thing that might not be totally intuitive is actually right here. If we want to insert an image, we need to go to a media library of your website. So we need to grab the link. If you're on WordPress, you're gonna do that from a media library and go to the image that you want to use in your pop-up. So let's say we wanna use this one. We're gonna copy this file URL. Let's copy that. We're gonna copy, paste that into the form and it will automatically put it here if you want, well, where's the preview? Sorry, save it. So now you can see it automatically sort of formats this nicely under the title. And so here you have a much nicer looking pop-up than you might've had without an image. If you have a Squarespace site, what you need to do is add a custom file. Sorry, I'll show you where this is. This is in the design tab design tab, custom CSS. If you have any code in here, go to the very bottom, manage custom files. And here you would add an image. So let's see, what do I have? Let's load an image in. All right, so X out of this. Sorry, you got to click on the image once you upload it. And so here you would just copy this URL. And then I'm gonna So in that case I'll come back here, delete that and paste that. And you see we have the same thing, that image will now be here. So that is how you would add the image to the pop-up to then have it be more styled and it's a bit more pretty than the generic template that's in here. Then if you're ready to put this code to add it to your WordPress or Squarespace website, all you need to do is copy and paste this JavaScript code and you can put this anywhere on your website. So it doesn't matter this is a demo site here. It doesn't matter, it's not gonna show anywhere on the site, but here on Squarespace, you would hit add block code, put it somewhere, 
replace this. And so you'll see it's not going to show anything, but it will display the pop-up on the page. It might not do it when we're looking at it this way. You can also look at the action here. Oops, sorry, this is the problem here. Show the form as a pop-up and the delay. Five seconds. I might just re-copy and paste that code now that I did that. See, there you go, there's the pop-up. And you would do the exact same thing on a WordPress website. You would add a code block, specifically a JavaScript block, if you are a theme builder, gives you that option, and you would paste in the code and you would have the same effect. So that is how you can create a nicer looking pop-up with an image, and then go ahead and embed it on a Squarespace or WordPress website if you are using Kajabi. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and drop a like on it. And you can always subscribe to the channel to be notified about future videos.